We're looking for the numbers here and they really do speak for themselves. There was about a 15% decrease in crime from the year 2021 to the year 2022. 2021 ended with 157 homicides while 2022 ended with 135 according to the Jackson Police today. We talked about getting more boots on the ground. The department saying they need about 65 officers right now. It was said today each shift there are normally 50 officers patrolling the streets less at night. Jackson Police Chief James Davis says his top priority is getting a temporary holding facility in place, something that has not been in the city since 2020. Chief Davis says this opens the door for repeat offenders. There's, they repeat the same crime over and over, and that is a morale issue for our officers because they happen to arrest the same bad actors over and over. Some incentive ideas for getting and keeping officers were thrown on the table, including creating internship programs with liberal schools and universities, loan forgiveness, cutting officers deals for housing to get law enforcement living in the community, and increasing the starting salary of officers to 55000 a year. And council members really emphasize the importance of having these conversations today and really being transparent about where the department is right now. We talked to council member Aaron Banks, and we'll have more from him when we're back live on the air at 6. Running live outside City Hall, Grayson Gordon, 16 WAPT News.